Set during the early days of e-commerce, Amazon.com versus BarnesandNoble.com concerned the patentability of online ordering algorithms. Amazon developed a method of single-action ordering that allowed users to purchase items with a single click. It patented its one-click system in 1999. Barnes & Noble developed a similar system called ExpressLane for its own website. Amazon sued Barnes & Noble for patent infringement. Barnes & Noble argued that Amazon's one-click patent was invalid because single-click ordering was obvious and the technology was already in use in the public domain before Amazon applied for a patent. Barnes & Noble provided several prior art references. CompuServe already offered a service by which subscribers could obtain stock charts through a single mouse click. Barnes & Noble's own expert testified that he developed an online ordering system called WebBasket that could save user information and retrieve it on subsequent visits by the same user. A book called Creating the Virtual Store by Magdalena Yessel discussed shopping cart software that could offer users an instant buy button. The district court concluded that none of the prior art references either anticipated the claims in Amazon's patent or rendered the one-click system obvious. It held that Barnes & Noble's ExpressLane feature likely infringed on the patent for Amazon's one-click feature and granted a preliminary injunction preventing Barnes & Noble from using ExpressLane. Barnes & Noble appealed to the Federal Circuit. It argued that the district court had misunderstood the prior art references, raising substantial questions as to whether Amazon's patent was valid. 